Sagittarius, how's it going guys? I am no longer reading reversals. Um, started that with Scorpio. I just got really tired of it guys, I really did. And honestly I think this is going to benefit all re readings in the future. I was saying in the other video that there is really no need to read reversals in my opinion because the cards will um, portray the energy positive or negative just simply by showing up in the in the upright so um, it is possible that in the future I might go back to reading reversals if that's something that seems to hinder the, the readings obviously I will change it but for right now we're going to go with the upright only readings so Sagittarius we just came out of your season um, I'm feeling very drained I have to say it was a very quick busy busy time I mean I don't know about you guys but I'm feeling like I need a good three weeks of solid vacation which obviously is not gonna happen we can dream we can dream the full card this is the third reading I've had the full show up for overall energy that's amazing um wow wow brand new start with someone um happiness oh my god that's beautiful strength you are rocking it right now Sag oh 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 my god okay you are feeling on top of the world I don't know how much better this reading could get let's hope it keeps going um wow okay wow overall energy the full card Ten of Cups in your past um, energy, currently feeling very strong, vitality, an offer in the future will come your way. Now this could be earth energy, does not have to be, could be water energy as well, could be, this could be your energy or someone else's, but you are fire, so this is probably you I'm feeling. Spirit, what can you give us for Sagittarius? Let's, let's go ahead and pull... A card for the Knight of Pentacles, the Hanged Man. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, the Hanged Man could indicate um, someone who is <sighs> contemplating an offer, um, letting go new perspectives, um, viewing the world in a different light. And this could be um, possibly a Pisces. So yeah, you got you got you got some options here. Clearly, oh, the magician just dropped out. Um, yeah, the magician is similar in that can bring opportunities like much like the fool, not necessarily um, offers of financial abundance, but could be a redefining moment in your life as far as um, inspiration, planning, offers, relationships, the the non-material world. Um, yeah, wow, Sagittarius, your reading is just kicking off. I mean, it's just like literally, like I don't want it to end. Um, wow, the, the Ten of Cups, I want to go ahead and clarify the Ten of Cups and the Fool. Who is the... Who is this person in Sagittarius' life that we have here? Spirit, what can you... What can you tell us about the Sagittarius partner? And who is this Knight of Pentacles? Is this you? Is this someone else? Okay. Let's go ahead and clarify it. Let's go ahead couple cards here for Ten of Cups. Um, we have the Empress, so I'm feeling a lot of fire energy. Um, but we also still have the water. So King of Cups could be a Scorpio, could be Pisces Cancer. To be honest, you have quite a few offers coming in um, with this Ten of Cups here. So it could be an existing offer that you're now deciding to act upon because you have, um, you, you have gone through not a 
terrible time. Uh, but you've gone through the thinking phase of it, okay? So you do have you do have a few offers here. So it could be earth, it could be water. You have a knight and you have a king. Mm -hmm. These are solid offers. These are not just like whims uh, that are coming in. It's, it's not kind of like a, a maybe situation. Like you have two <coughs> solid offers and your own defining energy combined with these offers indicates that you will make a, a very great decision. Um, that will ultimately lead to a new beginning with someone or, you know, the start of something brand new with someone that you've known that will make you very happy. So a lot of abundance coming through for you right now, Sagittarius. It's really beautiful. Probably my favorite reading that I've had so far um, today. And to round it off, let's go ahead and pull. Um, this is a new deck. It's called Work Your Light Oracle Card. Let me know what you think and then we will be done. So, Spirit, what do you have for Sagittarius going into the new year? Leap. Hey, that goes along with the Fool quite well, I believe. And Lucky of the Moon. Um, simple could be Cancer, could be Pisces. Leap. You go first, and the universe will catch you. Clearly, Sagittarius, you have luck on your side. Luck lucky is a word I would always use to describe Sagittarius. Um, yeah, because it's just, it's a, it's just a very lucky sign. Uh, looks like the universe is clearly on your side. Everybody is probably feeling your energy wanting to be around you. Um, <laughs> it means like you should just go for it at this point in time, which I know Sagittarius is love to just like dive straight in and like mad respect because your instincts are usually on point. Um, life bends for the courageous. The universe wants to support you, but first you need to leap to throw your life up in the air. Perhaps you know what you're being called to leap towards or away from and are scared to make the move. Maybe towards, maybe perhaps you're waiting for a big fat sign or an instruction manual or permission to do so first. If this is you, then this is your sign and permission slip to take a deep breath and leap into the unknown. Uh, it's scary to let go of all that we know and hope for something new. And it's normal to feel anxious at the thought of letting go of what we know for, for sure. Um, but this is unavoidable. This is the unavoidable process of rising, and right now, this is how you're being called to live. Nature is constantly showing us how to live with courage. Fall comes every year and encourages trees to loosen their grip, allow what was once so full of life to fall away leaf by leaf, and for a moment, it feels nothing will grow again. The branches are left bare with the comfort of what once was, but in the morning of spring, new shoots begin to appear, and something new is born that even is more glorious than before. You go first, take a good run, and leap. Leap for it. Um, yeah, if you if you enjoyed the reading, Sag, um, I would appreciate a like. Um, and subscribe if you feel that this resonated. Also, view any other videos that you feel will resonate with you. Uh, could be your Venus sign, Mars sign, whichever moon sign you feel strongly attuned to. Personally, I don't really do, I don't really align with any of those even though um I, t I sometimes will check out like my venus sign but mm, 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 it's up to you i'm not gonna not gonna you know say what you need to do hopefully you enjoyed it and have a great new year